Well, the experience of owning a specialty pet can be very rewarding and educational. That's why National Geographic and PetSmart have developed a new line of products for small pets, fish, and reptiles. Joining us today is Joel Satori, a world-renowned National Geographic photographer, and I tell you what, from Atlanta, Georgia, but Joel, you have been all over the world, haven't you? I have just about, I think every continent, all 50 states, some of them over and over again. Now we talk about specialty pets. What exactly is a specialty pet? Well, it's moving beyond just a dog or a cat actually to be anything from, from uh, let's say this bearded dragon in the tank in front of me, this really cool habitat looks like a Mayan temple, uh, over to freshwater fish in the aquarium to the left. They're in a 46 gallon tank that has a bowed front so you can really see them with LED, LED lighting built into it. And the habitat's really accurate. I mean, in terms of, of just giving it depth, there's a photo background there with a diver and it's, it's amazing actually, it's an experience. These are innovative products. They're just not, it's just not like your typical aquarium. And then behind me, there's an, what we call an exploration loft uh, for guinea pigs and hamsters and gerbils. And that's actually clear all the way around, so you can see in it anytime, see what the animal's up to. They can dig, they can run, climb. It's very cool and very innovative. Now, you've had so much experience over the years with these specialty pets. What can we actually learn from them? Well, yeah, I think it's huge now going forward. Most, most of us live in cities, not in the country. So we need a connection to the natural world to keep the planet healthy and to and just be thinking about it, have it on our minds a little bit. So I really feel that, you know, beyond going to a local zoo, having a pet in the home is really, really rewarding, valuable, and, and gets kids and their parents connected in a way that they just can't get off television or the internet, you know? Exactly, but when you bring those specialty pets into the home, you really need to learn and get some information and get to know what this pet really needs and their habitat as well. And that's a part of what National Geographic is doing as well, right? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. The, in Geographic's mission is to inspire people to care about the planet. And so if people go to petsmart.com slash natgeo, they can learn about each species, what they require, and uh, look around and really get a, get a feel for things and, and figure out, you know, which one's right for you, for sure. I also want to mention that we're going to have a, a Twitter chat uh, on June 9th, Monday, at 5 p.m. Eastern, if people want to talk a little bit more about all this and, and learn about what we've got going on here. It's pretty exciting stuff. That's some great information. Tell us about that Twitter chat again because people can go in there and get the answers and questions going on in real time instead of maybe emailing or, and waiting for a period of time. Tell us more about that Twitter chat. Yeah, absolutely. That, that's Monday, June 9th at 5 p.m. Eastern. So we'll tell any, people you know, all about this. And in the meantime, if they want to go to PetSmart.com slash NatGeo, some really cool interactive displays there where they can learn about each of the animals you see here and many more. Mm -hmm. Now, what is your number one tip? We may have already discussed that, but what's your number one tip for anyone considering uh, getting and purchasing a specialty pet? Well, I would say they're, they're quite easy to care for, but you do have to care for them a little bit. They require being fed. They, they require the right temperature. It's just, it's, it's with very little effort, actually, you can learn about them. And, and in these habitats, it looks so realistic. They're all based on where these animals actually come from. You're going to keep your animals a lot happier. They're going to be healthier and you're gonna enjoy them for years. Joel, some great information coming from Atlanta, Georgia today. You've got some great pets. Thank you for joining us and we'll get in on that Twitter chat as well. Thanks again and have a great day. Great, thank you. Thanks. And more after the break, so stay with us.